my darling Fumi Nation, how are you? How are we? Are we enjoying the holidays? I definitely am. I'm having a fabulous time. Fumi Nation, you are just so fabulous. Fumi Nation, you are just so fabulous. How many times did I call you guys? I called you more than once. One of you sent me a message and I did not think about it until i actually thought about it one of you has sent me this beautiful message and you had said fumi do you do neck exercises how does your neck look so good and no wrinkles i'm 49 and i see wrinkles on my neck help me fumi of course i will my darling of course i will so i wrote back thank you so very much my love yes i do i will do an episode if you like i do not go a day without moisturizer on my neck morning and night it's helped me a great deal as i will be 55 <laughs> I will be 55 in April. I cannot believe that I'm going to be 55. And when I say that, I am so grateful. I am so happy for life, for all the gifts that God has generously showered me with. I just am really, really, truly grateful. And I said to myself, I really have not done an episode on my neck since I got my skin tags removed. Yes, it's been a minute, my darlings. So for those of you that have been with me for a minute and a half, you will remember I had skin tags all over my neck. It is hereditary. My grandmother has it. My mother has it. My sister has it. And it was something that bothered me naturally because of what I do. And so I was very fortunate because I did an episode where, and I will put the link below of how I got rid of them. But what happened? They came back. And I was very fortunate because I bumped into a doctor, a dermatologist. It was pure happenstance. And he was actually looking for black models, for women of color models, because he had formulated this great formula to remove skin tags without removing or impacting my complexion. That's a big thing for me. And we're going to talk about this all the way in 2024. I want to be even darker. I don't mind, but I want to remove the hyperpigmentation that I have on my hands, on my knuckles. And so it was super important to me. And that's when I really started taking care of my neck. The skin on the neck is the thinnest and it is the most fragile. And one thing that I know for fact, as well as my neck, as well as everywhere else on my body, when I changed my diet, my skin looked like glass. When I changed my diet, my skin looks like glass. I am going to call my sister because my sister and I did this diet, detox, change of eating and the skin to the point that I did not have to wear foundation. Let me call her and see if I can get her on video. <laughs> oh, she's not picking up. Maybe she'll pick up later. Yeah, maybe she'll pick up later. My sister and I did this for about three months. And when I tell you, I did not, I almost did not recognize myself. Here she goes, here she goes, here she goes. <laughs> Arokus Kokus. Hello, gorgeous. I'm filming. Fumi Nation was saying, we love the neck. And I was telling them that you and I did a detox, a diet, a change of eating habit to the point that we no longer needed to wear foundation. Our skin was like glass. 100%. 100%. That's where I learned that you are what you eat. Absolutely. I've never worn foundation ever since. It's a, a pattering of concealer and that's it. There you go. Yeah, my skin cleared up completely. Okay, what did you have on your back? Oh, God. Back knee. Okay. I used to have horrible acne on my back. And that detox, since then, my back has... I, I, like I said, that's where I learned that you are what you eat. Because my back knee cleared up, never came back again. Just with a solid, simple diet. Removing all the fat and the sugars and, and all that stuff. Ah, I live for her. I do live for her. Well, you know, she's the brainiac in the family. You know how you always have the clever clogs? She's the clever clogs in the family. She forgets nothing. Ah, 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 ah. 
it can work against you. Spumi Nation, let me let her go and let me come back to you. Okay, I will holler at you the second I'm done. Okay, Mwah. I live for you. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, mommy. It starts from within. There was a lot going on with me. And like I said, because I was modeling, I was acting, I'm on YouTube. And you guys pointed out to me, Fumi, your dark hands. And thank you, Lord Almighty, that I'm a confident individual. So it doesn't bother me. I really just take it as you're looking out for a sister. Of course, I know some of you are trying to be not so nice. But I don't I don't feel... So, I'm, you know what? I'm, I'm, I'm 54, going to be 55. And so I realized that was a huge part of it. And do you know what... The skin tags never came back. Where it came back before, it never came back. The diet was huge. I'm going to climb on that and say, you got to stop smoking. You got to stop drinking, mama, because it will age you. I don't touch it. I just look at it like poison. I don't mind party, event, dinner. I don't smoke. I don't drink. I don't touch it. It will age me. And I want to have the very best version of me at all times. So you really got to be mindful of that, my darlings, because alcohol, mm, you don't need it. Honest to God, you don't need it. And I know it might be hard for some, but no, mama, you don't need it. You don't need to smoke. Another thing which I personally realized, I do not spray perfume on my neck. I spray it on my clothes from a distance, but I don't spray it on my neck. And then you go out into the sunshine. It's like frying an egg to the crisp. Do you know what that will do to your neck loops? Do you know? It will begin to give you all of the wrinkles. You don't want that. When I moisturize my neck, and you have to use retinol, my darlings. You have to use a retinol, any kind of retinol that you find pleasing for you. Because there are so many out there. You have to have a moisturizer. have to have sunscreen. You have to protect your neck. You just do. In the winter, I wear hats, I wear gloves, I wear scarves. I always cover my neck. I even have a balaclava, which I wear also just to really keep my neck warm, keep it away from harsh weather. And I do see the results. I do. I work from home and I'm on the computer and we find ourselves bending down constantly. I'll try and do it. If you bend down like that, you can now incur wrinkles. I don't have it. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just trying to show you your stomach. If you do that, you're going to incur wrinkles. So try to what? I put books on top of my computer and this is where I'm at. And when I'm with my phone, I'm very much like this. If you notice, even when I take pictures, I'm like that. I'm like that. Why? Because I do neck exercises. And so I take my hand like so and I press it into my jaw and I stretch it all the way like so and I stretch it all the way I also bring it all the way up and then I pretend I'm swallowing and you are strengthening your neck muscles here just bring it all the way back and I bring it to the side as well you see a lot of pictures I'm like this I'm just stretching out my neck I'm stretching because it's the first place for it to age. The thing is that we are women and we are fabulous and we are flowers. And I've said this so many times. We are the most exciting creatures on the face of this Mother Earth planet. But we also age faster than men. And so we have to be mindful of that, my darlings. So, with my cream, yes. And this, my darlings, <laughs> is superficial. is retinol anti-aging day cream. Yeah. So I just take a little bit like so onto my hands and I just massage it in. Yeah. And I massage it down to my decollete. I do it upwards. Upwards. I want everything to stay upwards. <laughs> That's what I do. I also wear neck masks every once in a while. You know, I'll treat myself. I'll go to the spa and they will say, oh, for me, you're looking fabulous. Your skin is gorge. And I say, yes, please take care of my neck as well. I'm really proud of it because I've been doing this consistently for 10 years and I see the difference. I just apologize because I thought I had done it on my channel and evidently I hadn't. It's been a while. You know, you massage your neck as well. Massage it. And sometimes when you massage your neck, 
and you massage your shoulders, you will be amazed at how you're relaxing the tensions in your neck. And all of a sudden, girlfriend, you're looking quite fabulous indeed. So use your oils. I use my deep oils. I use my creams, my lotions. I use my sunscreen lotion as well. And I make sure that I have my retinol. And it has made a huge difference. Water. Water, 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 water. Drink water and flush everything out. Why, my darlings? Because that is how you just get rid of impurities. Drinking a lot of water, changing your diet, and what? Reducing sugar. Because sugar is the killer for what? For your collagen. What is your collagen? That is your plumping properties that is what makes you look youthful that's what we see in babies that's what we see in toddlers and children you have that fabulous youthful appearance so those processed foods they gotta go exfoliate i do i exfoliate my neck because i wear makeup a lot of the times the nature of my job and a lot of the times I really don't care to wear makeup, but you got to look good when you're going out because I see fumination every day of which I'm terribly honored. I really am. I exfoliate my neck. One of the best exfoliators to date is the Zoe skin. It is like sand and that's what you need. Look at, I've almost finished it. I have to go get another one. Oh wow, foams. It is like sand and I just rub it on. Why? Because when I wear makeup, I want it to be fluid so that you cannot see the beginning or the start of my makeup from here to here. Do you see what I'm saying? And so I make sure that I have a fluid. So I do have makeup on my neck. Not today though, because I'm really doing very well. Well, it's winter. So I'm wearing a very, very light foundation. Should I show you? Okay, I'll show you. It's the MAC Studio Radiance Face and Body Sheer Foundation. That's where I'm at because my skin is really clear because I'm eating very well. I'm drinking my water. I'm minding my business. And I am sleeping very well at night. I just dream of beautiful things. It's such, it's such a gift just to dream of beautiful things. I dream of Ula. I dream of Adrian. I dream of my brand. I dream of my family. I dream of beautiful places on the beach. I love the beach. And so that's what I do. And this is the foundation now that I am using. It's the first time I am using such a sheer foundation. It's very, very light. i put a little bit here. Look at it. It's very light, but that is what I'm using now. I just don't need it. I don't need that thick foundation and I'm very happy. Sudden weight loss will cause wrinkles in the neck. Don't do it. Let this weight loss journey be an experience for you let this weight loss journey be a lesson for you you are not losing weight to be snatched you are changing the way you eat on a permanent basis and in so doing you'll never go back so if you gain weight you lose weight you gain weight you're yo-yoing you will succumb to having wrinkles or that turkey neck so you have to be mindful of that. Now, I know that this is the day and age of surgery and fillers and Botox. If you can afford it, if you really want it, if you feel this is what you want for yourself, go right ahead. Who am I to judge? Absolutely not. You want to be the best version of yourself. And I find that it really helps. And every and any individual, when you see their confidence come through, when you see them so confident and they're so happy and because they feel confident, they now have the courage to venture out and do so many things that they couldn't do because they felt they were limited. You see, mental health and mental imprisonment is an amazing breakthrough for anybody. And what you can do might be different for somebody else. What affects you might not affect the other person. And what does not affect you can affect somebody else. It is not easy to come out here in these social media streets and you don't feel good about yourself. Not what people are telling you, but how you see yourself. I say that because I want you to know that if you feel 
I really need this surgery. I have lost a lot of weight and I do see the appearance in my neck. Go right ahead and do your thing. I only say that go and do the research. Make sure that you go to the right doctor. Make sure you go to the right dermatologist. The last but not the least, exercise. Oh, for me, once I start exercising again and I get into that fabulous routine, I feel as if I'm treating myself, I'm spoiling myself. I begin to really take care of my diet, I take care of my nails, I take care of my hair, and I thoroughly enjoy it. And your skin is the biggest organ of your body, and it has to breathe. What helps it? The blood circulation. And that is how it just renews itself. And you see it all over. You see it all over. The second I start to really take good care of myself, lifting my weights and exercising and going out and just giving myself two hours to myself, treating myself, eating right, you can see the difference. And the beauty really comes out. And you don't need that much makeup. You really don't. You're looking fabulous. So that is it, my darlings. I hope you enjoyed this episode. You let me know down in the comment section. Should we start doing all of these treatments and um, how-tos? I do not mind at all. You guys let me know. Like I always say, darlings, it might be my channel, but for sure it is your show. <laughs> all of my love, darlings. Kisses. Mwah.